Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice algebra equation? From here, we are given x cubed plus x squared equals to 80. And uh, let's take this 80 to this side, and this will become x cubed plus x squared minus 80 now equals to 0. And here we can write minus 80 again as minus 64 minus 16. So we have x cube now. x cube plus x square. Then minus 64 minus 16 will now be equal to 0. Then in the next step, we can bring 64 together with x cube. We have x cube minus 64. Then plus x square minus 16 which is equal to 0 then from here let's express 64 to power of 3 as well so we have x raised to power 3 minus 4 raised to power 3 will give us 64 4 times 4 times 4 then plus here as well we have x square then minus we can express 16 as 4 square 4 times 4 is 16 which is equal to 0 then we can separate it like this we group this together then from here we have difference of two cube from the identity a cube minus b cube this will give us a minus b multiplied by a square plus a b plus b square this follow this pattern here then also we have difference of 2 square, we have a square minus b square, this is a plus b, then multiply by a minus b. So when we apply this here, this particular equation can now be written as, this first bracket become x minus 4, then multiply by x square plus 4x plus 4 square then the second bracket that's plus now difference of 2 square that's x plus 4 multiply by x minus 4 which will now be equal to 0 then from here we have x minus 4 common let's take it out we have x minus 4 then what is left in this first side, we have x square plus 4x plus 4 square, that's plus 16. Then on this side, we have taken x minus 4 out, we are left with x plus 4, then which is equal to 0. When we close bracket, equals to 0. Then let's simplify this bracket. This gives us x minus 4 multiply by, here we have x square plus 4x plus x that's 5x then 16 plus 4 that's plus 20 which is equals to 0 and we have two possible cases here we have x minus 4 equals to 0 or we have x square my plus 5x plus 20 equals to 0 on this side x is equals to 4 here then from here we solve this quadratic equation and then we have x equals to minus b that's minus 5 plus or minus square root of b square 5 square minus 4 a 1 then c is 20 then all over 2a that's 2 times 1 then when we simplify we have x equals to minus 5 plus or minus square root of 5 square we have 25 then minus 4 times 20, that's 80. Then all over 2. And 25 minus 80 will give us minus 55. We have x equals to minus 5 plus or minus square root of minus 55 over 2. And square root of minus 55, same thing as square root of 55, then square root of minus 1. And square root of minus 1 is i. Then when we put this here, so we have x now to be equals to minus 5 plus or minus square root of 55i 
over 2. Then from here, we can write our answer, final answers, and we have x1, the first one equals to 4. We have the second one, x2 equals to minus 5 plus on here, root 55i over 2. And we can equally write the third solution, and this will be x3 now equals to minus 5 minus root 55i over 2. So these are the possible solutions we have for this our given problem. Thank you for watching. Please share this video. Subscribe to my channel. Give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments, put it in the comment section. See you in the next class and bye for now.